The Colorado Buffaloes are coming off a 31 to 28 home loss to Kansas State. And that game played out about exactly how I thought it would. I had Kansas State for the first half in that game. And while my uh, criticism of this Colorado team has not always been well received, I think their weaknesses were glaring and obvious in that game. And uh, my analysis was quite accurate. However, Colorado will be an underdog on the road at Arizona this week. Do I like their chances? Do I think they can hang? We're going to talk about it. But before we do, I got to tell you about a promotion we have available right now at wagertalk.com for a limited time you can get the rest of the college football season only 299 bucks if you missed out on the uh, early season action no better time than right now to get involved at that reduced price this is available for any of the great handicappers at wagertalk.com including this guy right here and i'm still the number one handicapper with four percent and five percent plays at wager talk since 2022 also number one with football plays 4% and 5% since 2022. And uh, I'm up over 147 units with those 4% and 5% top plays in 2024 alone. As always, there's no purchase necessary. You're more than welcome to tune in just for the free picks. The only thing I ask from you is that you take the time to smash that like button, and that will allow me to keep doing these videos. Now let's get into it. Uh, The Arizona Wildcats will be a three and a half point favorite. The total's been bet up to 57 and a half. And as I said, uh, Colorado ran into a superior team in Kansas State, a more well-rounded football team. Uh, The fact that Colorado couldn't run the ball, they were negative 29 in rushing yards on 19 carries. Half of those were Shadur Sanders running for his life. Uh, The offensive line, again, couldn't protect the quarterback. Sanders was sacked six times. the offense, though, I mean, kept them in the game. It, it could have gone either way. In fact, if you got the three and a half, you still got the cover with Colorado last week. Um, that was irrelevant to me having the first half play. But, uh, yeah, Arizona, though, they're not Kansas State. Uh, they rank 10th in the Big 12 in total defense. They're allowing 359 yards per game. Their quarterback, Noah Fafita, was great last year. But so far this year, he's thrown for 1,636 yards eight touchdowns and nine picks. And if you just look at his four games against Big 12 teams, three touchdowns and seven picks. Uh, Arizona, they just don't look right. I I think this is a game that Colorado can hang in. These teams did play last year. Arizona won by a score of 34 to 31 within that three and a half point margin. We got a revenge spot here. Uh, Travis Hunter and Joe Horn are supposed to be back for the Buffaloes. I think this is a game and this is an opponent that matches up well for Colorado. So I'm going to take the Buffaloes plus the three and a half points. I bet you never thought you'd hear that from this guy. If you like this video, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel. And if you've got anything to say to me, even if it's nasty, hit me up in the comments below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can.